I think this year my content is really different. There is a, a huge footfall more than more than I've seen in previous years. So, um, so I'm really happy with with the with the quality and the quantity of people that showed up this year. Um, and uh, I almost had the hard time keeping quiet because there's so many people coming up to our booth and um, and you know and asking questions and very interested in what we do. So yes, this year we're very, very happy about the outcome. The panel discussion this morning about the process of content acquisitions in the MENA region was really interesting because we had strong speakers from, um, from the prominent um, uh, buyers in the region. Uh, two OTT platforms, uh, Estekana from Jordan and also uh, Shufmax from, from Lebanon. And also Abu Dhabi Media's children's channel uh, was represented by Ahmed Abdelhamid from uh, Majid Kids. Um, the highlights were that, um, you know, we spoke about different things. We spoke about um, how to protect the content in the region with the presence of pirates, um, also the process itself when it comes to uh, censorship, how they find that content, what it's based, what these decisions are based on. At MIPCOM this year in October uh, 2018, uh, the first, for the first time we were able, as Mina TV, to host a, um, a group of, uh, of very strong um, producers and also broadcasters that produce content, so uh, rights holders of Arabic content, um, to showcase their good quality productions to the world. Um, for the past 35 years, this hasn't happened in MIPCOM, and we're very happy for to be the first ones to pull it off. Um, there was a lot of interest from international buyers in Arabic content, uh, but uh, Mina TV is also about um, you know ma making Arabic content available to the world, but also to make the Arabic buyers um, available, you know, uh, more accessible to the world. So we on the platform, we also have a. Um, um, a, a nice variety of international companies that list their content and we make it easier to reach out to the Arabic buyers and put them in touch with them directly. If there's any barriers, language barriers or cultural barriers, you know, we make it easier for them to, to connect directly by recommending some distributors or, um, you know, helping out in, with languages and whatnot. What's missing in, in the UAE and in the region in, in general um, in terms of content, as we heard this morning on the panel, there is a big shortage from what I've heard um, of uh, kids' content. So their animations is very much in demand, uh, imported in, imported animations from across the world. Uh, we do have some stats that um, if you come by our booth and, and ask for, for the stats, um, that most of the, uh, the, the kids' content, the children's content, is acquired from um, Japan and from the U.S. Uh, so, you know, there is a, a big appetite for local producers to tackle that. Um, and also, what we've seen uh, just by the activity on the website, uh, the, the documentaries, the foreign documentaries are also popular um, abroad, uh, from abroad into the region. So there is a, um, um, an appetite for that uh, as far as acquired content goes. I think the ICM is very important for for uh, the UAE and for the for this region uh, because it's important a person fa face to face and put a uh, name to a face. So I've se I've seen a lot of times where people connect over Mina TV um, and they you know they don't sign the deal right away. They they um, they get invited and they're more um, likely to to come to this region and you know if they're able to to put a name to a face and the, the region is also. Um, very open to personal relationships, you know, and they're very loyal, like I said before, so it's, it's very important to have a gathering like this where you're able to meet um, somebody that you've been in contact with or somebody new and, and you know, and, and close the deals. It, it, if it doesn't happen today in the market, it will happen in the future. Thank you for having us here. It's a great market. I am liking all the happy faces everywhere around me. Uh, lots of familiar faces here and I'm happy, I'm really happy with the turnout.